Good morning, guys. Welcome back to Field Trips Panama. Welcome back to Los Buzos. Today's gonna be an epic day. We are mothershipping some kayaks. And I'm also gonna have a couple clients fishing the pond with me. We are heading down to the far spot, the legendary spot, San Patricio. This place is absolutely epic. Never fails to deliver. We're gonna be looking for some giants. We're gonna be doing some fishing out of the panga, and then as the kayakers hook up with giant fish, we're gonna run over, help them out as they need it. It's gonna be a good day. It's a long run, hour and a half. So we'll see you guys down at the spot. Yeah. You okay, Salida? Yeah. Okay. Oh. 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 <laughs> Holy yeah. crap. I'm shaking like a leaf. Great. <laughs> <laughs> Man, Woo. that was awesome, guys. <laughs> oh. We're out here trolling, oh, trolling yeah. the skirts. Got the triple of the mahis. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. Almost. Almost. Oh, <laughs> Don't be sorry. That's awesome. <laughs> you know, like you tell somebody who got slapped in the face by a big molly. Good luck hanging that hog. Moisture dick. Wow. That was on camera. <laughs> wow. There you go. There you go. Salita's on the jig. Oh, it might be a tuna. Yeah, the lights are. Ooh, wee! It's a tuna or a big banana. It's hard to tell with that setup. Definitely some kind of tuna with the way that rod's vibrating. See, see, see. Hang it, hold it just right there for a sec. Vamos a, vamos a tirarlo, see? Huh? You want to put it on your rod? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. It's not so important. All right, let's bring it in here. Sweet. Turn this guy into a cooper. Yeah. 
You guys wanna get your Gubera? If I get this kid's we gotta give it to Slater because she caught it and ladies first and all that. Yeah. Yeah. Did you get a Gubera last trip? Today's the day. No, I'm important. Well, let's go, man. Okay. No, no. Well, then you have to leave at your cat. Yo dije a ellos a poner extra mayonesa por pío. No. Solo sandwich de mayonesa. Ah, ¿qué son? Ah. Pow, pow, pow. Chica boom, chica boom, chica boom, ma. Haciendo los chiqui boom. Some of these words are so funny, bro. He always writes P U P I. Uh -huh. I had to do poopies. Look, man, they're yeah, going they're ape. Going at it. Wow. Coming snow. Yeah, not in the turtle world. Yeah, no. They got claws, they like latch uh, onto yeah. the women. Yeah, no does not mean no for turtles. They are the rapists yeah, of the sea. Got it upside down. Yeah. And uh, I was fishing with my girlfriend in February. Uh -huh. In the kayaks. Yeah? Yeah. Hey, Salita, Salita. Oh, yeah, hang on tight. Please don't lose my rod. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's something good on the bonita. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah. Okay. Hang on tight. You want me to get this out? Hang on yeah. tight. Okay. Okay, okay yeah. Guys. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Something big on the live bonita. Oh, yep. Yeah, hang on. Salita caught this bonita, put it out, and uh, that was five minutes ago, I think. Something big. When it does slack up, you can try to pull up. It's not right there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. There you go, there you go. Yeah, whenever it slacks up, try to gain some ground, and then when it pulls, obviously just chill. But anytime it gives you a break. Big fish on the live Bonita. This is on my personal setup, the Shimano Speedmaster and the stand-up tuner rod from Tackle Direct. Pretty bulletproof setup, but uh, doesn't make it easy. It's something big. We're thinking Big Kubera. Oh, oh. He's still way down there. Yeah, when it slacks, try to reel. Try to reel. I know it's tough, but we need to get some like separation out the bottom, you know? So any chance you get right now, once we get him up a little ways, it's a little more tranquilo, but... Gotta get him up off those rocks. Oh, perfect, he's doing great. Keep it up, keep it up. Yep, yep, yep. There's only a couple things this could be. And they're all gonna, they're all pretty rad. Oh yeah, oh, rip and drag. The thing is locked down. Slate is hanging on for two life. <laughs> you got it. Oh wow. Uh, yep, yep, now real, real, real. You can't, oh, my God, okay. Salita's hit that something giant on the live bonita right now. It can be easier to kind of lift up and then reel down. Yeah, there you go, yeah. Use your back a little bit. You strong, independent woman, you got this. This is gonna be something good. This is her second time here, her first time here with me. She caught a nice rooster. She did not get a Kubera, and that's kind of what we're targeting with this bait, and kind of what we're hoping it is, what I'm hoping it is. Knock another species off her bucket list. La bonita. Si es un boada, se pica este, va a ser muy grande. You're getting close, ish. <laughs> it was a long way down there. You came back a lot of land, though. You're doing great. You're doing great. Big, big fish, you guys. Sleet is getting it up. Oh, it's coming up. I see it. Silver plateado. Creo que gallo. Oh, wow. See, I think it's a huge rooster, you guys. A huge rooster. Oh, puedo ver la bonita. Está ahí afuera. Something humongous. No sé, no puedo ver. Possibly voila. Voila, grandote, huh? Might be a humongous Amago, Jack. Man, that'll be dinner. That 
It tastes like grouper. Si, si, yo también. Café, color café. Wow, grande, huh? Oh, wow. Wow, humongous AJ. Oh my gosh. Tienes, tienes a. Wow, so little. Woo! Huge Almaco Jack. Oh my gosh. If you can bring that line to him, holy dude. That's a monster. 50 pounds all day, all day. Tiene el café. Oh, oh. Oh, que anima, amigo. Wow. Holy dude. That's like 70 pounds. 70, ¿qué crees? No, posible más. Más, sí. That's the biggest one I've ever seen. El más grande que yo lo vi en mi vida. And I saw, I've seen many, and she, you fought that fish like he Oh my God. No wow. puede ser. Wow. No puede ser. Salida. <laughs> fish bigger than you. <laughs> Más grande que ella. ¿Qué necesito? Vamos a ver. Sí, vamos a pasarlo para allá. Puede despertarlo un poco. Wow. Amigo. <laughs> No puede ser. Holy shit, yo quiero un foto también. We're all gonna get photos with you. <laughs> okay, 80 más posible. Oh my god. Look at that. Are you kidding me? Salida just caught the biggest Almaco Jack I've ever seen in my whole life. 80 pounds, 90 pounds, no sé. You gigantic fish, you guys. You know, oh. Hey, size of the fish. Like Caught your own fish? Like, Did it all? What? It was, Loco. There was no moaning, there wasn't any grunting from us. Uh, yeah. Oh, like this? Oh. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Wow, look at this. Biggest Almago check I've ever seen caught here. Slita caught her own bait. Put it down. Five minutes later, she fought this fish up from deep. What an absolute monster fish. Oh my gosh, Slita's not her first trip here. Wow. Slita here from the Carolinas. A little bit different fishing than she's used to, I think. Incredible job. Wow, wow, wow. Like that sideways. Just like that. Okay, you do it? I'll let go and I'll get a picture, okay? Okay, one. You ready? I'm ready. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Congrats. Woo! Okay. Good start. Good start. What's up, buddy? Loco! What a fish. We got another fish on the same bait, you guys. <laughs> yeah, so that mangled bonita that just got eaten by the 80 pound. Oh, yeah. Cubera, creo. Yeah, keep, yeah, don't, yeah. So that same bonita, we just put it back down, all mangled, put it back on the hook after that 80 pound Almaco Jack ate it, put it right back down, and right away we got another fish on the same bait. Second, second giant fish on the same bait. My good buddy Juan Carlos here from Austin Canoe and Kayak, one of the biggest uh, kayak retailers in the country, not this country, the United States. He's on the rod this time, and uh, it's something big. It's feeling like a Kubera, he's working like a boss. It's coming up. <coughs> it got down in the rocks, he got it out. Oh, I see it. Kubera. Kubera. Nice. <laughs> Same bait. Oh, oh, oh. Grabarlo. Oh. Cuidado. Bro. Same bait. Look at that, catch a fish on used baits. Nice, man. 
<laughs> wow, what a 15 minute little blitz here. 15 minutes. Una carnada. No, wow, look at those teeth. See those teeth? Sick, bro. Watch your fingers too. Look at that thing. Fangs. First Panama Cubera. First Panama Cubera. Look at that. Water bounds. A peril line coming soon. Good friend of mine here. Just been having a blast with this guy. And there's his first Cubera in Panama. Look at that. Look at the, those chompers. Wow. Yeah, watch your fingers. Is it toss it? Uh, no, uh, hang on to it. Still played in the water. Yeah. And uh, look at this. One bait, two giant fish. It's a pretty good start when it's in the water. Uh, look at that. Uh, we may have to revive her a little bit, but I don't think so. I think she'll go. Problem most of the time is the air bladder. You know? But um, she doesn't seem too full of air, so they usually tell they're like a balloon. Just watch those spines on top of you. Wow, man. Great fish, beautiful. Try to set it down? You can try to put, yeah, like push her down or drop her down, like lift her up and just drop her hard. There we go. Oh, Woo! took off! Wow! Oh, man. Phew! Bro. Awesome. <laughs> Sick. All right, guys, so we got an 80 pound Almaco Jack on a Bonita. It was all mangled, but the Bonita was still there. We just put that same Bonita back down dead and caught a Cubera. The other boat's bringing you guys two Bonitas. Fish these Bonitas hard. Don't be doing anything else. The Bonita bite is on. We just caught two giant fish with one bait, once alive and once dead. Um, they're out here. So, uh, yeah, let plenty of line out with those Bonitas and, and, and cruise around with them. And if it dies, Make sure you gotta wait. If you need one, let me know. I'm gonna drop that down over the reef. Um, we just no, caught no, no, no. Kubera on a mangled one and a, an Almaco Jack of a lifetime on a live one. So, Bonita Bite is on. <laughs> you got it. Crazy morning. It's been, been like an hour, one bait. Yeah. Uh, we barely got to do anything else but reeling giant fish. It's really, it's really kind of annoying, you know. I'd like to do some jigging. <laughs> Sick. Number three. Oh, good one, man. What was that on? You know what? The bonita. The chunk. The chunk of bonita. Wow. Oh, fuck, Nicholas got the bonita chunk rooster bite dialed in. From the pieza de, de bonita. Mira, woo! Nice. Thank you. Of course, I had to. This rooster. Okay. Did you take your measurement? Maybe, man, but he's 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 gonna die if, okay. if we All don't. Okay. Right. Um, oh. Fish finder. Fish finder. Fish finder. Get it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, dale, dale. Todo profesional. Yeah, you gotta like deep throat them, stick your whole hand in there, throw it yeah. Okay, we're gonna revive it, okay? Yes, Great catch, man. I think uh, I've never seen these caught on chunks of bonita, and you caught two gonna nice it, ones, bro. Gonna make That's gonna be a new a new staple. Oh, beautiful rooster, bro. Another nice one. That's three. The hat trick. Ready? I'm going to lift it up, though, and then drop it, okay? Looks like he's got something. Ryan here from Utah. Looks like he sipped up something on dead bonita we just gave him. It had two hooks on it. Ah, oh, see, that's one up this. That's one piss. Yeah, he's got something. We just rigged him up with a dead bonita at the end of the day. We put an extra stinger circle hook on it. That's a fish, buddy. Keep working it up. You're doing great. 
You're doing great. Ryan here from Utah. Literally the last minute of the day, we were coming over to help pick him up, and the lion got caught in his rudder and then got hit while it was in his rudder. Super precarious position to be in. We ran over, got it free, and now he's free of the fish and finding something good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hang on, you're doing great. When it slacks, you reel down. Yeah, exactly. Go ahead, reel, 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 reel. There you go, there you go, reel, 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 reel. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, when it's pulling, you let it go. As soon as it gives you some leverage, work it up. But you've gotten some good ground on it, man. Perfect. Look at this, overtime. We were joking about this is your Hail Mary, and look, here it is, buddy. Oh yeah, yep, yeah, don't let it slack. Reel, reel, reel. There you go. Man, good effort, bro, good stuff. Oh, careful. Perfect. Keeping that rod tip forward, perfect, man. Real, real, real. There you go. Nice. When it gives you some slack, yeah, perfect. There you go, buddy. You're doing great, man. This fish is kind of come up. It's coming up. It's got to be getting close. Oh, oh, spoke too soon. Well done, bro. You're doing perfect. You can't horse these things up, yeah. Panamanian sleigh ride right here, man. This is, a, this, this is something, it's digging. Ultimo minuto del día. Ahí estaba en su rabo, todo. There you go. Remember one foot four when, it start, when you think the fish is close? And once it starts getting close, pay attention. Don't let your swivel, don't reel your swivel into, you know, be looking for your leader, basically, and don't reel that swivel into the tip. It's coming up, man. It's coming up. It's close. What color is it? Silver. Bateado. Watch the swivel. Oh. Watch the leader, okay? Watch the leader. You don't want to reel it in. Oh. Bro, I think... Yeah, it's got it's a, a, a rooster or bumping up. Gallo. Gallo. Creo. Gallo. Rooster. Rooster, bro! Alright, you want us help later? Are you gonna grab in the gill plate? I think you could do it. You're a beast, bro. But you tell us you want us to come help you land it. Are you just grabbing that gill plate where it means to jump, but be ready, he may make another run. Keep one foot forward. Keep your pedal separate still. I know it's a lot. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Hey, could you take that? Yeah. Get me to record it. Woo! Oh, yeah, but it's like we're not done then, okay? Keep it off the boat. And uh, I'm gonna grab your line, but I'm gonna be ready to let go. So you just treat it like I'm not even here, okay? Because if he runs, I have to just let go and you just gotta be ready. Okay. Uh, it's okay, it's okay, okay. He's tired, so okay. Keep it tight though, keep it tight, keep it tight, keep it tight. Real, real, real. Okay. Come here, come here. Bro, there it is. <laughs> Let's get this thing on your lap, okay? See how I got it in there? Yep. You're gonna do the same on the other hand, okay? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, there's another hook there too. Hold on, don't tight. Hold on, don't tight. Really. But, uh, okay. 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 All right, bro. There it is. The last minute, bro. Get it on your lap. There you go, like. Yeah. yeah. Ryan from Utah. High West Whiskey. High West Whiskey. This guy been grinding, been working hard. We gave him a last minute Bonita Hail Mary. Oh my gosh! Literally, it's time to go. The line got caught in his rudder. So much could have gone wrong right then, but he got it done. Incredible, bro. Nice work. Oh my gosh, fish of a lifetime here for Ryan. 
from Utah. Not too many of those in Utah, I'm guessing. There, I don't think so. Yeah. <laughs> How was that fight? Oh, that was awesome. Yeah. All right. I'm going to push him off. You want to revive it or you want us to? Try it for a minute. You want to? Yeah. So you'll grab his bottom jaw like that and try to keep his mouth open. And you'll just pedal him around. Same direction I got you? Yep. Facing him forward. Yep. Either whichever side is comfortable. Try to keep his, get his mouth down in the water. You may have to kind of lean down, like kind of, you almost lay down in your chair. Congrats, bro! Just landed a fish of a lifetime from a kayak, no doubt. But it's time to get out of here. Happy clients, got some giant fish today. It's been a bit of a grind, but there's been some big fish out here. A little bit of everything today. Woo! We gotta go. We're far from home. It's getting late in the day. You got an episode now. <laughs> Zeros. Seventy four pound Almaco Jack. Voila. For Selena here, what a monster. I remember this one for sure. That's awesome. Of course. The biggest one I've seen for sure. It had to have been 80 when we, when we caught it. All right, Dakota Dunmire is going to start flying this guy. We'll probably tag team it a little bit. Monster of a fish. Man, we don't have bots for our row here. <laughs> Nicolas forging for his hook. Out of his pumping though. There you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it is a tank. That is a monster. Eight. An absolute monster. Just like looking at like the, the spine. Yeah. You know, like those these are the vertebrae. What an animal, dude. Crazy thinking these things are swimming down there. It's like freaking brontosaurus ribs, dude. No crappy filet. <laughs> Ready? Oh, wow. So Ryan and Denny here both got their first roosters today. They get a free shot at the rooster fish bar and grill. Good choice. Congrats, fellas. An absolutely incredible day out on the water. Biggest Amaco Jack I've ever seen in my life. Roosters, Kuberas, sailfish biting the spread. Just absolutely wild. Bunch of other fish were caught. What an incredible day. Everyone's in high spirits. That big Amaco Jack is going to be dinner. I got permission to go back in the kitchen. We're going to see how they're going to cook it up. And in the meantime, we're just enjoying some drinks, enjoying each other's company. Having a good time, there's nothing but laughs and smiles all around. Life is good here at Los Buzos. So that's what deliver a little bit more than that. There we go. I'm proud of y'all. It's not awkward, is it? Nope. Oh, that's bad. Like a and I've seen it at his, but he doesn't have it there. He always like, I'm not Quick sear on both sides. 
literally like 30 seconds. We started. Yuka for a side, one of my favorites. It tastes like a potato, a root vegetable. So good. Once that's done, he's gonna put it right below there in the salamander. You can do it in the oven, basically. So before it goes down in the salamander or in the broiler, he's gonna add more of this lemon butter caper sauce. This stuff is so good. Look at that. Oh my gosh. It smells so amazing. Finish that off in the broiler, and then we're gonna be ready to eat. Oh yeah. This is gonna be amazing. This is one of my favorite fish dishes here, and the Alamo Jack is perfect for it. Giant Almago, it's still gonna be delicious. It's basically, might as well be Groover here. This lemon butter caper sauce, my, probably my favorite cooked fish dish here at Los Buzos. Phenomenal, so good. Even for an 80 pound fish, super tender. You would think that a, a fish that old, that big, wouldn't be. That's so good. Salida, thank you. You're the real MVP. Got special in-house sauce for the fried yuca. It's so amazing. Some kind of green garlic aioli. I don't know what it is. It's amazing, but really the star of the show. Oh gosh. Still fight me. Got off the hook. Got off the fork. Amazing, you guys.